breaks and I'm burned by the morning light I'll make the same mistake more than twice Same song, but brand new dance I wear out my third second Hello friends, um, this, um, welcome to another cash stuffing video um, For this week, um, I am going to cash stuff cash stuff my um, wallet insert so as if you have watched my previous videos about my cash categories and budget system um, I didn't really discuss my cash uh, my wallet inserts there it's because I don't usually or I don't regularly stuff these inserts but I only do so when I need to go out for an errand or like if we have we need to go out for the day and like spend something for the day um, so what usually happens is I pull out cash from my weekly um, envelopes, my weekly binders, and then take out some cash that is enough for the day and then transfer that money to my inserts. In this way, I avoid, to over, um, not really avoid, but I minimize <laughs> the um, possibility of overspending. So I don't really usually film these videos. If you have seen, I only film like how much I spent for the week. But this video, um, this cash stuffing is quite um, an exception because in here it is, I am showing um, a reality, um, at least my reality, when it comes to expense, when it comes to situations where my expenses exceed my budget. Um, in here, um, there are a lot of expenses that it, I did not foresee or I did not expect. It's because these expenses are usually taken care of by my husband. And recently, he quit his job to look for an opportunity to work from home. His, his previous job was on site and it was really, it was just quite an inconvenient because he had to travel an hour I mean two hours but it's quite far and there's an opportunity that he can work from home so yeah he grabbed that one so in here I'm just showing you my inserts these are my inserts and these are just bought from national bookstore these are actually just ID card holders one of these only costs um, around eight pesos to nine So as you can see, um, I owe, I need 8,100 pesos for the week. This includes my in-laws medicines. Yeah, mostly the, that part, my in-laws medis medicines, I did not foresee that, but that's okay. So in this video, I ended up going beyond the budget. I'm just taking out, um, I'm just taking out all that I could, I could except for Noah and Sushi's budget. So since Noah and Sushi are my priority, their needs are non-negotiable and their budget should not be used for other types of expenses. Meanwhile, um, I'm just taking out as much cash as I could to use it from all other expenses. Here I am just stuffing 1,000 pesos in Noah and Sushi's inserts. Um, I bought diapers, wet wipes, and um, I forgot Noah I Sushi's dog food. So Sushi's dog food is actually uh, we can just buy her dog food from the grocery store, so we didn't really have to go to the pet shop. And then I pulled out another 1,000 pesos for my father-in-law's diabetes me medicines. No, it's the glucometer test strips. So I'm just going over these expenses by priority. So I think what they did here is um, set aside money for Noah and Sushi and then my in-laws medicines and then um, groceries for my mother-in-law. And then, um, no. After the medicines, we I okay. Let's just <laughs> okay. Let's just go over the video. So I do not know what happened here. So I just got it. So as I mentioned, I just pulled out as much money as I could from any envelopes. So budgeting is really not just about dividing money. It is also about being able to choose 
um, your needs over your wants. I am now setting aside um, 300 pesos for my father-in-law's medicine. By the way, the um, that's if you can't see, that's actually the budget or the needed amount versus the actual amount. That's another 300. Next is for my mother-in-law's medicine. That's 150 pesos. So I'm putting all the med medical needs in health. In total, we have 1,450 stuffed in my health insert. Now let's set it aside. After the medicine, um, the next priority is the internet bill. It was only 700 pesos because we split it with my husband's cousin. So that's 700 and I'm just going to put that in my obligations insert. After the bills, now I have to look for 2,100 pesos for my mother-in-law's um, groceries. So earlier this week, I already gave um, 2,000 pesos for their personal groceries, but, th but this one is for her store, like the inventory needed. At this point, my goal is just not to touch my savings, so since the money from my week 1 binder was not enough, I ended up pulling out cash from my week 2 binder. So despite taking out cash from the week to binder, I still have to make sure that there is enough left for um, the week to expenses. So the good thing is, I mean, it's not it's not exactly the good thing, but I have envelopes here that are not con considered as needs, such as creativity and dining out, since since these are not priority expenses, then I and I could just um, give up on this on this one and um, like <laughs> choose the, the needs over the wants. I'm not counting how much I'm pulling out here. I'm just pulling out as much as I could and making sure that there's enough left for week two. Now I think we can stuff 2,100 for my mother-in-law's groceries there. That's 2,100 going to our um, groceries inserts. Insert. This, um, while filming this video, it was really stressful. <laughs> like looking for cash, making sure that there's enough left for week two. I'm not even sure it's enough. But at least for now, I didn't touch my savings. And unfortunately, since I still have to look for 1,500 for my husband and my groceries, again, um, the money left is not enough. So I ended up pulling out more money from my um, week 2 binder. I took out some cash from the week 2 budget for groceries, more from dining out and miscellaneous. As you can see, non stuff but that's fine. I think we can just adjust or we can just do um, um, live week two with a tight budget but that's fine as 
you can see here I already have 1650 that is actually more than enough since I only need 1500 for our week uh, for our groceries So that's it for our very um not not very like quite stressful cash stuffing and budgeting thank you so much for being with me and see you next time bye day breaks and i'm burned by the morning light i make the same mistake more than twice same song but brand new dance i wear out my third second